Hi, I'm Ken Potrock, Senior Vice President and General Manager for Disney Vacation Club. And I'm very grateful to you for allowing us into your home today so we could tell you a little bit about what makes Disney Vacation Club membership so very, very magical. Imagine creating a lifetime of memories, going on vacations you'll never outgrow, and all the while staying in the middle of the magic. That's what it's like to be a Disney Vacation Club member. When I get out of the car, everything is so magical. I take that deep breath of, we're here. You feel like you're with family and friends from the minute you walk in the door. It gives us an opportunity to bring family together every year. They greet you with a smile. They talk to my children. When I hear welcome home, I get a warm feeling inside that I'm being greeted by a friend. You just get a smile on your face. It's just, it's just a great feeling. What does it mean to be a Disney Vacation Club member? Well, first, let's check out all the accommodations, the amenities, and the many benefits our members enjoy that truly make them feel right at home. And to do that, we've invited none other than renowned travel expert, Samantha Brown. Hi, this is your intrepid travel investigator, Samantha Brown here on an amazing assignment to discover what Disney Vacation Club is all about. Today, I'm gonna to be traveling deep into the middle of the magic to check out this extraordinary vacation ownership opportunity, and I'm taking you with me. But first things first, if we are going to truly discover the unique benefits that come with being a member of Disney Vacation Club, we're gonna to need to fit in. And what better way to do that than with a little pixie dust. Welcome home, Samantha. Follow me, please. Wow, it must be working. We're here at the Top of the World Lounge, located at the top of Bay Lake Tower at Disney's Contemporary Resort. In a little while, this will be the place to be. Why? Well, I don't want to get ahead of myself, but let's just say you'll get a real bang out of it. <laughs> okay, let's focus because we have got some investigating to do. Now, there are 12 Disney Vacation Club resorts where members can stay, so where do we begin? How about here? Just look at this view. I can see Magic Kingdom Park. It's right there. Bay Lake Tower at Disney's Contemporary Resort is just one of the extraordinary resorts Disney Vacation Club members call home. It's got a uniquely modern touch, classy design, I like it. But what I like the most is its location. Talk about being right in the middle of the magic. You're just a short walk or monorail ride to the Magic Kingdom Park. And if you're looking for somewhere to unwind in the middle of the day, you can pop over to Bay Cove Pool, then later head back to the park recharged and refreshed. But hey, maybe you're looking for something a little wilder. We're in Disney's Animal Kingdom Villas at Kadani Village. Now this resort offers an experience unlike any other. Every detail transports you to the rich culture and natural beauty of Africa. From the exotic flavors of Sanaa Restaurant, to Samawati Springs Pool and Yuwanja Camp Water Play Area for young explorers, to my favorite, the Savanna, which is home to an assortment of animals that roam free outside. And in most rooms, you can see them from your own balcony. Now that is what I call a backyard. You know, I've always wanted to have my own pet giraffe. <laughs> Thanks, Disney Vacation Club. The next resort on our investigation is Disney's Saratoga Springs Resort and Spa, where you'll find yourself immersed in Victorian splendor, inspired by the lakeside retreats of upstate New York. Oh, would you check out those treehouse villas? I don't know about you, but I would go absolutely nuts if I could wake up with that view. Saratoga Springs offers tennis, dining, and a relaxing spa right on property. It's ideally located close to all the dining, shopping, and entertainment of the downtown Disney area. Plus, the Walt Disney World golf courses are just a chip shot away. Next is Disney's Boardwalk Villas, which recaptures the fun, elegance, and excitement of turn-of-the-century Atlantic City. Located on 25-acre Crescent Lake, this resort is a water lover's haven. I mean, what's cooler than a thrilling ride on the 200-foot-long Keister Coaster water slide at the circus-themed pool? Now, if you're looking for activities on land, then you're just a short stroll from the bustling shops, restaurants, and live entertainment of the boardwalk. It is a not-to-be-missed hotspot. 
Ah, oh, next up, the casual elegance of Disney's Beach Club Villas, which carries the theme of a laid-back seaside village with turn-of-the-century New England charm. Hey, laid-back is my middle name. You can soak up the sun on the white sand shores of the lake or take a leisurely trip on the lazy river at Stormalong Bay, the three-acre water wonderland. Disney's Boardwalk Villas and Disney's Beach Club Villas are also within walking distance or a short relaxing boat ride to both Epcot Park and Disney's Hollywood Studios Park. Do you know what the very first Disney Vacation Club Resort was? It's this one right here. Disney's old Key West Resort, home to many magical moments for thousands of Disney Vacation Club families since opening in 1991. What's that? Hello? I'm sorry, you're gonna have to speak up. I can't hear you. Oh, yes, you're right. It does blend the unique culture and flavor of Florida Keys with the imagination of Disney. Thanks, I was just gonna say that. Now, one of the favorite places Disney Vacation Club members love to go to is Olivia's. They're famous for their omelets, conch fritters, cheese grits. Oh, cheese grits. Sorry, I'm getting a bit carried away, but what makes it really special is what it means to members who have been coming here year after year. Uh, one of the things we love about uh, coming here is uh, Olivia's Restaurant. Right when you walk in, you've got pictures of uh, some of the first founding members of Disney Vacation Club. The menu is reflective of the atmosphere here, which is it's Key West. If you're looking for that get back to nature feel, the Villas at Disney's Wilderness Lodge offers a breathtaking getaway inspired by America's great national park lodges with rustic furnishings, tall timber, and even a nearby geyser. It's everything I love about the wilderness, but without the Samantha eating bears. Along the white sand shores of Seven Seas Lagoon, you'll find the newest addition to the Disney Vacation Club collection of resorts, the villas at Disney's Grand Floridian Resort and Spa. It's easy to spot. Just look for the striking red gabled buildings. It is the picture of Victorian style and luxury. The stately villas are an ideal mix of sophistication and modern comforts. As part of Disney's Grand Floridian Resort and Spa, you can lounge by two beautiful pools or take your appetite to any of the six restaurants including the elegant Victoria and Alberts, recipient of AAA's Five Diamond Award. Now we're going to leave the Walt Disney World Resort and head over to the Florida Treasure Coast, where we'll get a look at another Disney Vacation Club Resort. Now, how am I going to do that? Only there was a way. Oh, yeah. I still have a little left. Here we are at Disney's Vero Beach Resort. This beautiful beachfront resort harkens back to old Florida and the tranquil atmosphere you'd expect from a stay at this legendary beach. Plus, all the conveniences and amenities you expect from a stay at a Disney Vacation Club Resort. With its spacious villas and standalone cottages, you'll feel totally at ease the moment your feet hit the sand. And if that's not relaxing enough, the spa at Disney's Vero Beach offers eco-friendly treatments that are pure heaven. Cap off your night with a romantic beach walk and some campfire sing-along fun. Along the beautiful Carolina coast, you'll find Disney's Hilton Head Island Resort. So beautiful. Secluded on an island within an island, this nostalgic recreation of quaint vacation homes is nestled under the shade of 100-year-old live oaks that surround the Great Lodge. You'll also find Disney's Beach House located along Hilton Head's legendary 12 miles of gorgeous sandy white beachfront. I think of it as Southern Charm with a Disney touch. Heading all the way across the country, hi Oklahoma, bye Oklahoma, to Disneyland Resort in California, we find ourselves at the villas at Disney's Grand Californian Hotel and Spa. You can see why it's called Grand. This luxurious craftsman style resort steeped in the California arts and crafts era is right in the heart of the Disneyland Resort. You're just steps away from downtown Disney District. It even has its own entrance to Disney's California Adventure Park, where you can cruise into the amazing Cars Land. Wait, wait, is that ukulele music I hear? Better get those hips swaying because we're going on a little island hop. 
say aloha to Aulani, a Disney resort and spa in Ko'olina, Hawaii. This magnificent beachfront resort combines the majesty of Hawaii with the magic of Disney. Nestled on a beautiful tropical lagoon between the Pacific Ocean and the Waianae Mountains, Aulani offers guests the quintessential Hawaiian experience for families with Disney. And as part of this resort, Aulani Disney Vacation Club Villas lets you call this magical place home and provides members access to all the spectacular amenities. One of the things you'll notice about Aulani is Disney's dedication to giving its guests an authentic Hawaiian experience that celebrates the culture and tradition of these beautiful islands. Welcome home indeed. No matter which Disney Vacation Club resort you stay at, you can enjoy a full kitchen and laundry area at your disposal. As a big family, you know how nice it is to have a full kitchen. You will absolutely love having everything at your fingertips, including all your dinnerware, pots, pans, serving dishes. I mean, you really have everything you need, including a dishwasher. You got your four top stove, large oven, full-size refrigerator, and here's the best part. Take a look. <gasps> My refrigerator is already stocked. You can call ahead and order online, and they will go and do your grocery shopping for you. We have a full-size kitchen. We have a refrigerator, a stove, a microwave, a dishwasher, and they're the same appliances, basically, that I have at home in my own kitchen. It's like I've never left home. You will notice this beautiful wood carving of the angelfish here in the cabinet. Well, there's a little more than what meets the eye because this beautiful cabinet is actually a bed. Perfect size for the younger members of your family, or actually it's, it's long enough for me. Now these are included in some of the two bedroom villas, and let me tell you, the Keiki just love sleeping in their super secret bed. Wow, with all those amenities, or as I like to call them, the good stuff. It's no wonder Disney Vacation Club members feel so at home. You know, home means something different for everyone. So do vacations. They come in all sizes to fit all needs. Well, I'm back at Kadani Village at Disney's Animal Kingdom Villas to see if Disney Vacation Club has that covered. Oh, I think we have it covered, Samantha. Welcome home. Thank you. The pixie dust is still working. Now we're talking. You know, my husband and I were just thinking about a romantic vacation for two, and this deluxe studio would be ideal. It's got a kitchenette with a fridge and a microwave. I can practically smell the popcorn for our movie night. Hey, but what if you want to bring the kids? You might want a little more space. Members have the flexibility to choose a one-bedroom villa that easily fits up to five people and features a fully equipped kitchen with a washer and dryer. But hey, maybe your kids are a bit older and you are looking for a little bit more privacy, right? Then look no further than this two-bedroom villa. Check this out. The kids get their own bedroom and you get your own bedroom. Plus, there are two full bathrooms. And if you really want to be ambitious, you can fit up to nine people in here. But oh, did I mention privacy? Wow, now this here is the magnificent three-bedroom grand villa, and from the looks of it, I bet that it can easily sleep up to 12 people. You know, I'm having visions of a brown family reunion, and I can invite the whole family. Even our own wild animal, Uncle Larry. Our home resort is the boardwalk, and it is really enjoyable because it is so flexible for our needs, depending on how many people we have in our entourage on a given vacation. So this particular trip, our sons and daughters-in-law each have their own one bedroom so they can have their children in a quiet space and then they can have their own living area and their own quiet space as well. You don't have to be a great investigator to see that one of the great benefits of being a Disney Vacation Club member is having the flexibility to vacation when you want, where you want, how often you want, from romantic getaways for two to family reunions of 12. I mean, it really looks like Disney Vacation Club has the flexibility to take care of almost any type of vacation their members can dream up, plus the perfect room to suit the occasion. And if you can believe it, all these room choices are just the beginning. Members get a whole lot more, which means there's more investigating to do. And I know just the place to go. 
I'm here outside the Atlantic Dance Hall at Disney's Boardwalk Villas for Welcome Home Wednesdays, an exclusive Disney Vacation Club get-together where members and their guests share stories, trade vacation tips, and just have a good time. Now, if there's one thing Disney Vacation Club members like as much as their Disney Vacation Club membership, it's talking about their membership. And what's one of their favorite things to talk about? All the places you can stay at around the world using your membership, of course. Now, check this out. Did you know that as a Disney Vacation Club member, you can go on one of those Disney cruises or adventures by Disney you've heard so much about? It's all possible when you purchase directly from Disney. What's so magical about a Disney Cruise Line vacation? Well, for starters, there's something for everybody, adults, kids, and the entire family. As you set sail to places like the Caribbean or the Bahamas, you might find that time on the ship is as much fun as your destinations. From dazzling Broadway quality shows to on most voyages, the thrilling fireworks at sea, the magic never ends. And if you're looking for a bit more adventure, then Adventures by Disney can show you the world as you've never seen it before. And you don't have to be a travel expert like me to take part in it. Each Adventures by Disney vacation is led by two Disney-trained adventure guides, along with top local experts who share the stories of the amazing places you'll visit. Heck, I am a travel expert, and with more than 20 destinations on six continents, I'm sure I'd learn a thing or two. And if that weren't enough, Disney Vacation Club gives its members the world. That's right, you'll have access to fantastic member getaways, to many of the world's most exciting destinations, places you've dreamed about your whole life. That pretty much covers a lot of dreams. When we got into Vacation Club, at first it was just about Disney and about our coming to Florida and, and, and to the resort. However, we've only been members a couple years, but we've already done a Disney cruise to the Bahamas and an adventure by Disney to Wyoming and Yellowstone, Jackson Hole. It was by far the best family trip we've ever taken. Our adventure guides held our hands through the whole thing, took great care of us. That was the trip of our lifetime, best family trip we've ever been on. Well, our journey has now come full circle. We are back at the top of the World Lounge where we began our investigation. Now, remember how I told you that this was the place to be at night? Well, if you take a look behind me, you're gonna see why. We have got a great view of Cinderella Castle at Magic Kingdom Park, which could only mean that you've got a top of the world view of the spectacular fireworks show. Disney Vacation Club really does put you right in the middle of the magic. I don't know about you, but I don't want the pixie dust to wear off. And with Disney Vacation Club, it doesn't have to. When we were out watching the fireworks, uh, I was out there with my mother on the balcony, and we were looking over Cinderella's castle, and it was changing colors, and all these beautiful bright fireworks were going off, and I just hear her ooh and ah, and I just got giggly, because it was like watching a little kid. And she heard me giggle, and she looked over, and she just took my hand, and her eyes were all twinkly, and I just saw this big grin, like this big thank you. She didn't take a moment of it for granted, and it just made it even more special. Well, uh, this looks and sounds like the perfect time for me to wrap up my investigation and introduce you to a Disney Vacation Club expert who will explain how membership works. Hey, thanks for joining me. Take it away, Michael. Thanks, Samantha. Now, that's a tough act to follow. When you take a look at all these amazing Disney Vacation Club resort locations and the endless activities for everyone, it's no wonder our members love coming home again and again. Hello, I'm Michael, and as a Disney Vacation Club guide, I've helped many families learn about the value, flexibility, and benefits of membership. Families just like you wondering if Disney Vacation Club is right for them. So what does being a Disney Vacation Club member mean? It means that you're purchasing a deeded real estate interest in a Disney Vacation Club resort. That real estate interest is represented by vacation points. Simply put, it means you can vacation when you want, where you want, and how often you want, year after year, creating a lifetime of memories. Think of vacation points as Disney Vacation Club currency. Every year, members receive an annual allotment of vacation points to design their vacations. You'll use them to book accommodations when you come home to any of our uniquely themed Disney Vacation Club resorts. And check out thousands of other vacation options in destinations around the globe.
Plus, when you purchase directly from Disney, you'll be able to use your vacation points to set sail on Disney Cruise Line, explore the world with adventures by Disney, and more. One of the great things about uh, Disney Vacation Club membership is that uh, it's not like a timeshare where you have a, this one or two particular weeks out of the year that you have to go on those two weeks. So let's take a look at how easy it is to plan a Disney Vacation Club stay using our Vacation Point system. The first thing you should know is that the amount of vacation points you need depends on a few simple questions. When do you want to vacation? Where do you want to vacation? And what type of accommodations do you need? That's the beauty of membership. The when, how, and where of vacationing is totally up to you. Purchasing a membership in Disney Vacation Club does not tie you to a certain resort, room type, or even time of year. Our vacation point system allows you the flexibility to customize each and every vacation individually. So as your needs change, so can your vacations. We can stay at any of the other locations. There's one in Hilton Head, Hawaii. You have a lot of options that it's on points and you're not locked into the same place, the same time every year. It's flexible time, flexible locations. How do you know how many vacation points to use? Good question. The amount you'll use for each vacation depends on when, where, and how you choose to vacation. For example, a week-long family reunion in a grand villa during peak season will require more points than, say, an overnight stay in a deluxe studio during an off-peak season. It's that flexibility that makes Disney Vacation Club so remarkable. Vacation points make it easy to create the perfect vacation any time of year. Say you want to host a big family reunion in a three-bedroom grand villa or spend a week in jolly old England, but you don't have enough vacation points. You can bank them and add to next year's allotment or borrow points from next year. You can have three years' worth of vacation points to use for your bigger vacation. I'm sure by now you're asking, how exactly does this vacation point system work? Well, I'm glad you asked. Here. Let's take a look at a chart like you'd be using to find exactly how many points you'll need to fulfill your upcoming vacation dreams. Simply select the Disney Vacation Club Resort where you want to stay, the dates of interest, and the kind of accommodation you desire. The Vacation Points chart spells out exactly how many points will be needed for each night or even each week of your stay. You'll have the ability to customize each and every Disney Vacation Club Resort stay right down to the size of the accommodation. So the larger the villa, the more vacation points you'll need. It's that simple. You'll also notice your chart covers 365 days a year. There are absolutely no blockout dates. And as I mentioned earlier, the busier the season, the more vacation points you'll need. The less busy the season, the fewer vacation points you'll need. I mean, I want to be able to change it up and, and come when my kids are out of school and come when my husband and I have free time. And that is huge. It allows you so much freedom and flexibility in, in your ownership with, the, with DVC. There are really three main costs of membership. Purchase price, closing cost, and annual dues. Let's start with the purchase price. Now, your guide will work with you on what size membership is best for your family but let's take a look at an example using 130 vacation points. The initial purchase price is simply either a one-time payment or payments that could be financed through Disney for up to 10 years for qualified purchasers in most jurisdictions. I'll explain how prices are calculated in just a few moments. To help you get a feel for costs, let's use Aulani, Disney Vacation Club Villas, Koalina, Hawaii. The initial purchase price is calculated by multiplying the size of the real estate interest by the price per vacation point. Using our 130 vacation point example at Aulani, simply multiply the 130 by the current price per point and you have the initial purchase price. As you might expect, there are one-time closing costs as associated with any real estate transaction and they are calculated based on the number of points you purchase. In addition, there are annual dues each year. They are similar to homeowners association fees and help cover the operating costs for the resort, such as property taxes, landscaping, insurance, utilities, and maintenance. Annual dues are based on the amount of vacation points you purchase and can be paid on an annual basis or every month with no interest. And 
Though they do increase as operating costs rise, annual dues at Aulani have only increased an average of 4% in the past three years. In this example, here are the annual dues. Finally, should you decide to vacation away from Disney Vacation Club Resorts and use your membership to book accommodations at any of the thousands of vacation options and destinations throughout the U.S. and the world over, there is a $95 per transaction fee. Of course, your friendly member services representative will be more than happy to arrange the booking for you. They're very flexible and very helpful and very thorough, and they do often help me think of arrangements that need to be made that I haven't even thought of myself. Now that you have an understanding of the basic cost, here's the true vacation value. Going back to our example of a membership with 130 vacation points, imagine staying in a deluxe studio accommodation at Aulani. This may even be similar to accommodations you're used to staying in, but you'll enjoy the added benefit of Disney Vacation Club amenities like a kitchenette. For example, let's say you plan for a trip to Aulani in December 2014. Using your 130 vacation points package, you can stay for five nights in an Ocean View Deluxe Studio. If you took the same vacation and paid cash, your accommodations alone would run you the amount shown on the screen. Imagine taking that same vacation each year for the next seven years. Here's the cash price you would pay for those vacations, which would have been more than your initial purchase price, closing costs, plus seven years of annual dues. Using this example, after seven years, the membership would have paid for itself. So if you like to vacation with this type of frequency and want to enjoy quality accommodations at Disney Vacation Club Resorts, you see how quickly the cost of membership can pay for itself. And keep in mind that the amount that you'd be paying in cash each year is likely to go up with inflation. But as a Disney Vacation Club member, you don't have to worry about that because you're locking in today's rates. Well, with the presentation that we were presented and they exactly broke it down and how it would benefit you over a 50 year period, my goodness, this is wonderful. And Tommy said, well, I want to go back to the room and think about this. So he did. He went back and he got his paper out and he's calculating and then he says, Call them up, tell them we'll be there at 8.30 in the morning to sign up. I said, okay, I'll be happy to. The numbers don't lie, and it's just a, a good value for what you're doing. You're committing to family vacations with Disney. When we first were thinking about it, we were unsure, and we've added on six times. I just looked back on all the experiences I've ever had with anything Disney-related, and it's all first class at, at any time. So there you have it. Now you can see why more than 500,000 members have found that Disney Vacation Club makes good financial sense. The long-term value you receive for the family vacations you might take anyway is incredible. Hopefully I've answered most of your questions about what it takes to be a Disney Vacation Club member and how our vacation point system works. But more importantly, I hope that the member families you heard from today showed you the even bigger value, the value beyond the numbers, of how Disney Vacation Club can help your family create a lifetime of vacation memories. When we first watched the planning DVD, we thought about what kind of options were available. I remember us seeing Italy and thinking, we could stay somewhere in Italy for this many days. Are, are you, is this possible for us? And I think that really got us thinking that we wouldn't be doing this if we didn't have the points, if we weren't members. So what's next? It's simple. Your journey to creating a lifetime of memories begins like every journey, with a first step. And it's an easy one. Just pick up the phone, call the number below, and talk to one of our Disney Vacation Club guides and ask the questions that relate to you and your family. There was no pressure. I mean, absolutely no pressure to buy by the timeshare they they you know they told us everything about it but um, you know we didn't feel like oh you know we got to sign something or we have to we have to commit before we leave and so we walked out we went back to our room and and we talked about it we actually did the math I did the math I mean for a lot I mean he crunched numbers like uh, it was and we're like you know I think we should do this <laughs> We didn't have any pressure at all. In fact, we were the ones calling them and saying, OK, we're interested. We want to do this. It really is that easy. 
We're here to answer your questions and help you understand how Disney Vacation Club membership might make sense for your family. No obligations, no pressures, just answers. Then, who knows? It may even be me who gets to be the first to say, welcome home. You walk in that lobby and the thing they tell you is welcome home. And it's what I tell my family is we're home. They say welcome home because while we're here, we're part of their family. It's just a great feeling to come back home here. We decided it was right for us. And there's no regrets. It's one of the best things we own. Every day since we've joined, we kind of kick ourselves for not joining sooner. It's just been the best experience. Paying for this right now is going to give us decades of vacation time that right now we wouldn't even think about taking. Disney goes above and beyond everything they do. They named it correctly, the Disney Vacation Club. It's worth it. You have to do it. Probably the best decision we've ever made. Welcome home. Welcome home. Welcome home. <laughs> okay. Thanks again for watching and for getting to know more about what Disney Vacation Club membership can mean for you and your family. As a father of two young boys, I know that family time together is simply precious. And I sincerely believe that when it comes to vacations, you'll find no better place to spend that time together than right here with us. Year after year, on vacations, you'll never outgrow. And when you visit, we look forward to greeting you with those two magic words, welcome home.